Good morning everyone, how are you? I hope you are fine. Today our lesson will be about if we have any differences between uh, the animals. So we will learn about are there differences among animals of the same kind? Let's see together. I am teacher Mirna al -Karut. This is grade 2 and we are teaching subject science. Let's start. So first of all, look at this picture. What can you see? We have different animals and different sizes and colors of them. So we will learn today the differences among animals. Now look at this picture, this beautiful picture. What can you see? What is this animal? It has feathers and beak and wings. So this is the bird, of course. Can you see differences among them? We have this one is red and this is white. This, is, this one is green and this one is colorful. This bird we call the parrot. So look at this picture too. We have different colors of the same bird. So the parrots can be different in color. Now look at this beautiful bird. It is actually very small. Look how beautiful it is. But look how much small it is. It is the size of your finger. So this bird we call the hummingbird. The hummingbird is small in size. It's very small. Now how about this bird? This is the eagle. It is very huge and big. So the eagle is large in size. Now look at these two birds. What are the differences between them? We have this one that have feathers. The color of the feathers differ. These are colorful. These are white and black. And also the size and shape of the beak. Look, this one is very big and this one is small. Now, so we have differences among birds. We have the small ones and the big ones and we have the colorful ones. So the birds can be different in size and color. Now look at this animal. Do you remember what is this animal? It has connected scales and it lives on land. So it is the reptile, of course. Let's see the differences among the turtle. This turtle is a little bigger and it has different uh, color. Can you see? This is very green and this is a paler green. So look at this one. It's bigger and bigger. Look at this one. It's even bigger. So did you notice that the turtle can be different in size and color also? Now look at this animal. What is this? This is the snake and it has scales. So it is a reptile. Now let's see. We have a small snake and we have a bigger snake. So the snake can be different in size. It can be small 
and it can be large. How else can it be different? This snake is green. This one is yellow. And this one is blue. How weird. So the snake can also be different in color. Now let's look at this animal. What is this? This animal feeds their young milk. So it is what? It is a mammal, of course. This is the cow. Let's see other cows. This one has brown hair and white. And this one has entirely brown hair. So the cow can be different in color also. Now how about this animal? So it lives in water and it has gills. It is the fish, of course. Let's see other fish. We have this fish is bigger than this one and have different color. And this one also. Look at this one, it's yellow. So also the fish can be different in size and color. Now, how about this animal? This is the cat, of course. It is a mammal. You know that. Now, what is the differences between these cats? First, we have the color of the fur is different from here and here, right? Also, look. The size and amount of fur, these fur for these two are very tall and fluffy, while this one are shorter. So, the cats can be different in size and color also. This is our lesson. Let's review together. We learned that animals of the same kind can be different. How animals of the same kind can be different in their color and size. This is our lesson for today, my dear students. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. And always remember that even if we have differences, we can always be friends like these animals right here. Study well, my dear students, and good luck.